Hi, my name is Hena. I head the operations here at Urava Indigenous Science and Technology Study Center. We are an organization working in the area of sustainability, climate action and rural livelihoods. Uh, we work with the medium called bamboo, uh, bamboo the green gold uh, and we work in different verticals of it. So I've been here with the organization for the past six years. I think I joined here in 2017 uh, when the organization was almost in a shutdown phase. So it was more of a rebuilding phase uh, for the past two, three years. Then the COVID came. Uh, but now I think we are more of settled and we are more looking at the development stage of it. So right now we work at different verticals in bamboo we work around around bamboo in different verticals let's say we start off from nursery planting we in our nursery we have around 60 to 70 species different kinds of bamboo uh, we start off from there, we, we also collaborate with uh, farmers and uh, different organizations to grow bamboo. I think that, that is very important to grow bamboo and it is one of the fastest growing plant with uh, it, it, the carbon sequestration capacity is super high too. So I think in, in this era, it is obviously very important that we plant more bamboos. Uh, so we have a nursery planting. Second, we have a vertical called the livelihood support program. Livelihood support program is where uh, we have artisans, more of local people, uh, everybody in the village or mostly people in and around 30 kilometer radius around this village uh, mostly people who are part of the livelihood support program are women uh, and they actually make a lot of they are given trainings and they make a lot of bamboo products so what you see behind me or around me are all bamboo products made by them uh, so we have the whole se section and that's something of a livelihood support program most of them is their primary livelihood and there are different kinds of support that we give to them uh, it might be training support design support marketing support space support so there are different levels of support according to whatever they need uh, two we have so uh, apart from livelihood support program we have something of the trainings and workshop that in itself is a wing whoever is interested in uh, knowing more about bamboo or uh, learning some art or craft uh, in bamboo uh, we we are open to it we actually collaborate with schools colleges and people from different walks of life come in for our trainings and workshops are uh, even tourists just a tourist may come in and would be just interested to learning more about a little bit uh, go deeper into bamboo so we have small sessions let's say three hour programs to six day a week program to months of program so it is more of train our trainings and workshops are more of customized programs whatever the require whatever your requirement is we can do accordingly uh, just that we'll have to just check that it doesn't overlap with any other trainings but yes we we are also open to trainings and workshops we also take up projects we also take up projects in the sense that we collaborate again with one interesting project that we had done was for uh, Indian Institute of Science Bangalore for developing mathematical toys in bamboo. Uh, the last project I think we completed was for UNDP. Uh, UNDP and before Corona, I think before the COVID times, we had one in Sri Lanka uh, for UNIDO. So we, we do take up a lot of projects in that sense um, and collaborate and partner with other organizations. Um, we also have our interior wing and all that. So it's more of a, if you check, it's more of a, uh, bamboo organization and end-to-end -end bamboo organization uh, and I think uh, that is what we have been we have been trying to bring out lot more verticals to bamboo as part of our expansion as part of our growing up uh, so uh, we have been trying to step we, we have all, almost stabilized the whole a whole process of it and looking for uh, more avenues to I think uh, send the message or uh, propagate the idea of bamboo uh, and maybe with, with the core focus obviously on livelihood and uh, rural livelihoods and sustainability. So in the range of products we have different kinds. Uh, we have gifting products, we have utility products, we have jewelry, we have uh, home decor items. So there are different category of products that we have. I'll just show you a few, I'll just introduce a few products to you. Let's say uh, in our utility or home, uh, home utility product we have trays so these are bamboo trays we have bamboo trays of different sizes different shapes different designs so all these are different kinds of bamboo trays that you see we have baskets all those fruit baskets uh, 
not just those sim we we have simple other designs also so there are different kinds of products that we make uh, under our utility category this is more of an upcycle product this is a beer bottle but uh, we have upcycled it and we have woven around it can be used for storing your honey uh, on your table and it's also a decorative product other than utility uh, products we also have let's say corporate gifting products or for your uh, dining table or your offices sorry office tables uh, so you have these uh, small clocks plus let's say pen stand and for your card holders and all that uh, again this is another clock so there are different uh, varieties of uh, products or product category that we have so this is another product again a gifting product and for your offices this is a laptop stand uh, you can adjust the height of the laptop stand but it's a very simple and easy to carry laptop stand and again a uh, 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 not a plastic one a substitute for your plastic ones or any of that kind it's a bamboo uh, simple bamboo utility uh, laptop stand uh, again there are different varieties of pen stands and pens uh, we make again these are pen stands you can you can actually find a lot more designs of pen stands that we make and also bamboo pens uh, again another gifting product i would like to introduce is something called the book of spices uh, we have it in three different uh, sizes this is our medium size book of spices which is quite handy uh, it is one of those best gifting options that we have it is called the book of spices with locally sourced spices in so this is how it look like a book where you can also customize it with your name or brand logo so that it is good for your clients too so it comes with a small book inside which actually talks about all these spices in we have uh, small quantities of cardamom cinnamon pepper clove all spices and star anise in here we have it of three different sizes uh, this is a small size almost half of it while we have it in a really large size so these are the three different sizes that we have uh, one of our best uh, gifting product maybe an alternative for your diwali uh, uh, diwali gift hamper can you can actually give it as a gifting product for your diwali or any any of those festivities if you are looking out for a new gift please come in here uh, another interesting product i would like to show you is something called a bamboo amplifier this actually would be uh, you'd be you would be might be reminded of those gramophones which were there in olden days so this almost looks like a bamboo gramophone we also call it that way uh, so this is i'll just try playing you could just keep your mobile in and it just plays so this again can be dismantled and carried back uh, so again uh, this is easy to transport in that sense uh, you could actually carry in your hand luggage another area that we work is bamboo is something called bamboo blinds uh, bamboo blinds or for your homes uh, we it is, this is mostly a fully hand crafted or hand woven it is actually woven on a loom on a hand loom uh, just like you weave your sari a different way we actually weave these bamboo blinds it is uh, mostly customized according to your window sizes or your door sizes we actually customize our bamboo blinds we have it of different designs and shades we also have a similar product called bamboo uh, a smaller version of the bamboo blinds are these ones these are bamboo table mats for your dining tables so other than corporate gifting or gifting or utility product or home decor product we also have our jewelries uh, so these what you see are uh, those hand woven bangles these are fully uh, handmade ones and even the inside of it it is a fully hand made bamboo bangles there is nothing else but bamboo in here even the base of it uh, is bamboo basically you can actually find it in different designs and colors 
Uh, what you see, uh, what, what I'm wearing is bamboo earring. Uh, we have something called Manjadikuri, uh, Man Manjadikuru, which is available in Kerala. Uh, we get, I, I'm sure that it is available there also. So we get it here locally. So we added those red color with the Manjadikuru, Manjadikuru here. Uh, we also have uh, small tiny locket chains for you. Uh, so the, other than other, other areas or verticals that uh, we have in product section, we also have jewelry as one of our core areas. So for the home decor product, one, one line of product is for your wall, for your wall hangings. So what you see here are more bamboo paintings, uh, painted uh, paintings hand, hand painted on bamboo. Uh, on, on the other side, the small pieces that you see are for your fridges, those fridge magnets. So that can be taken back as a souvenir or as a small gifting product. Uh, so what you hear, the, everything behind me is more of uh, a wall decor piece and finally we have a range of lampshades so uh, I think what you see here are just a few models of our lampshades we keep on uh, bringing new designs in our lampshades at minimum 10 designs a year so but these are obviously our major uh, one of our major focus area on, in our product section is our lampshade um, so different design different patterns it can be customized for for a bulk order we can also customize according to what your design is uh, and your aesthetics and all that uh, so all this actually you can find here at uh, uh, Urubu Indigenous Science and Technology Study Center here in Vyanad in Kerala. Uh, you could actually contact us uh, before coming and give us a ring before. You could actually find our details in at urubu.in uh, in our website and also in our Instagram page. It's also called urubu.in. U R A V U dot i in uh, so i really hope that you guys could come here or at least call us and if you need any information or you would want to order something you could either place it through instagram or give us a call we'd we'll be happy to uh, happy to work together with you thank you